And your marshmallow face. Oh. Let's dance with it. <clears throat> Welcome back to Let's Cash More Mash. My name's Tom. And I'm Mike. And today, we're cracking open a new bottle of Pinhook Rye Humor. So, <laughs> so this was a tricky one to try to do a little research on because every year, they've been doing this for many years now, and I don't remember exactly what year they started. Although they say this one was a three-year one, and this was cropped in 2018. So I'm thinking it actually started in back in 2015 is what my guess is. But what they try to do is they try to pair an up-and-coming thoroughbred horse with one of their rye whiskeys. So this one is 114 proof, or bourbon, or, or, or bourbon whiskeys, whatever whiskeys that they have. This is 114 proof. It was $49.99. So the mash bill is over three years old. It's aged and blended and proof by Sean Josephs at the Castle and Key Distillery in Frankfort, Kentucky. So, and again, mixed reviews. Some people mentioned MGP with some of the rise. I, I'm not 100% sure on the facts on that one. The concept is cool, and the fact that they do it, they come out, each one, if you look at the bottle, has, like, what the proof is. It says the name of the horse, how many hands the horse is, uh, gives you the sex, the stuff on the actual bottle, Color. what they actually paired of. So, rye humor itself, at the time, uh, probably not to date, but back when they were doing this, it actually had 16 starts, 3 wins, 3 places, 2 shows. And over $83,000 in earnings. So it's not a bad little horsey anyways. But uh, we'll see how the whiskey is. That was one of the better cork pops. I don't know if I'm going to get that wax off that little guy right there. But it's got an extensive wax going on here. Yeah, it's, and, it's, and like, it's almost like a wine bottle too. It, yeah, it's, it, it's, it's tall. It stands out. Yeah, it, it stood out. And that's the reason I, I snagged it. It was, I hadn't seen them. It's kind of neat. They do it every year, since, too. Man. Since then, they have been in a couple of different places that we go to. But different variations. Right. Diff right. Yeah, it was different years, different proofs. Right, because I actually found a couple at my store. I snapped a picture of it just to see, and uh, they weren't any of this. And it was only like 96, Same. 100 proof. Yeah, yeah. Where this one's 114 proof, so we're going to give this one a try. But uh, And if it's good, we may go get the other two. Yeah, and again, this was in 2018. And, and they've we come didn't pay out, attention a year when you... I, had, I probably I, have a picture. It might have the picture. I, I have no idea. Again, yeah. I didn't know anything about it until I do the... This is Neither kind of, One of the cool things I have in a collection is that I end up doing a little research and trying to find out the little things on it. And some of the facts that you get on some of these well, things just, is just in, in marketing, pretty cool. Again, this was a whole marketing thing. Yep. Taller bottle and anything that, that I've seen. And then with the color, different color waxes, it just stood out. A hundred percent. And every year they have a different colored wax. Yeah. So when I was doing a review, I'm like, wait a minute, this has a, a teal wax when the other one had an orange wax. Yeah. And I'm like, what's that? And then I had to go look and it was a different year. And so my facts it may might be, even been the, the bibs that colors that they wore. And it could have been, but again, it was just one of them. Like right. when you're trying to do research, it's hard because you not only have to get the name of the it's horse. Total, something mm -hmm. different. Let me see. You, you have to try to figure out the year that they put it out. Oh, no, it ain't. The, huh? No, it ain't. It's got a different It's voice. a rye. Put that in your head. Put that in my head. No, I didn't mean it like being <laughs> rude. I meant like... <laughs> no, no, it's got that... You get that minty... It's not peppermint. It's like that winter mint pine. That I keep saying that. I can't come up with any other thing. Like, that's what jumps into my head. Now, now I see that. Like, but I have others that smell like a... Scotchy too, but this is not you, right. Not that. You've been saying that. I've been waiting for you to say it's got the scotch. No, smell. it doesn't. This get, gives me that winter mint pine. Yeah, yeah. Like that's what I. That's the only way I can describe it. Let's see what it tastes like. That's what makes me think when I and I don't know. When I was doing research, maybe it was I do research on so many of them. I thought it was an MGP product, but they said it was made by the Castle and Keys, which we haven't tried yet either. But it said it was blended and proofed by them. That didn't drink 114. 
You can, but I didn't I didn't take a big sip. But you know it's that one right there. Up there. Hold on, because now the, the hug's coming. So I didn't switch it and it's still no, tingling I'm gonna, on I'm my gonna, I'm gonna do that on the next one. But with that being said, maybe it is MGP and it's just blended and, and mixed at the castle and key. I'm not hundred percent sure. Couldn't tell you. I but, bought it because it was a cool bottle. And it might have been something else that I just bought that was MGP, and maybe this is 100% Castle and Key, but. All right, let me, let me give it a thing. I do like the 114 proof, though. It's got a good taste. And it does. I just around. did an aggressive swish on that okay. one. Oh, that's like straight up mouthwash when you do it like that. Like it's burning in all the yeah, like all the all the areas I hit. Still there. A nice. It's got a woody finish, or oh, rye, whatever. It's got that little aftertaste finish. Mm -hmm. It does have a again. I it, it yeah. It's I, got a good sparkle though. This it, one. It, they didn't have a mash bill on it, but I'm gonna say it's a higher rye. Well, it says that. Does it say 95.5? Well, it just said. It wasn't it? Wasn't. Does it have the mash bill? Or it be no, probably in the back. It doesn't. But I thought it said high rye or something. We have one that says straight high rye in the name. It's not this one. That's, I, an, that's did, another one I we have read over the there. <laughs> that's another one we have over there. Though. That says over there. That says straight high rye. Oh. I don't know what the mash bill would probably hey, be. That, that's the 122. Mm. Could be. It, it's drinking like a 114. A, a tasty 114. The, 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 the aftertaste almost gives it's, me... It's not the traditional Pop Rocky. I'm not getting the Pop Rocky. I'm getting the proof. I don't want to say flow. I'm almost, it's almost tea like. I'm almost getting like, and I'm trying to think of what tea. I don't want to say like jasmine or anything that was super floral, but I'm almost getting the, uh, I drink the teas all the time. I'm almost getting like that aftertaste, like like that. Well, I don't get really the Pop Rocky as much. I get the numbing. I get the, 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 the Orgel. Or the, so I got, I get the Pop Rocks to begin with. Yeah. And then I get the little Orgel sitting. Like you, well, 114 though. I'm not getting that huge Kentucky hug. If you take, like you get you off take of, a, uh, a, like Booker's when it just sits there, and it's but like, if you take a good sip, you'll. Oh no, you'll I'm feel it. I'm sure. I'll go back to back. You, you know, you're not drinking mm -hmm. 80. It's it's. I it's, definitely get a proof. Don't get me yeah, wrong. Yeah. You get a proof. Yeah. But it's not a harsh proof. It's no. like it's this is nice. But if you sit here, yeah, you, this, you, is, this is this is like what it. I don't. I don't think anybody would sit here and guzzle this. No. Hey, plus, and you're you're a moonshiner if you guzzle it. Yes. <laughs> no, it has a whole. Because you could sit. Although I will say, tongue, finish still, wise, it's not overly long. Syrupy. It, it, it's not overly like it doesn't coat. It's there. It's a. You it, get the numb. Yeah, numb. And then it goes. The numb stays. Like not, my tongue is numb. Still I've had numb. longer though. You know what I mean? Like I would say, short to medium. It's not like the. Like to me, book has sat on your tongue for days when we did that one. Like it just, it just was so there for days. We went, oh, even, even with like knob, knob stays longer than what I think this does. It's like, a, yeah, it's a syrupy kind it, of. It kind of coats you yeah. when it sits. Where this one kind of is there, gone. You know what I mean? A, a couple little, 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 little lasting after yeah, effects yeah, yeah. on the yeah. sides and stuff, but it doesn't like coat your whole mouth and stay oh, with you. Stays on you your You do tongue. get a nice little hug yeah, yeah. on it. I do not hate it. I, do, I, I would I say, if you it. can find it, <laughs> if you can find it, go get it. So when it comes to, I'm trying to think now, out of out of all the right, I, I figured you would come. I was I was pouring slow for that. I wanted to, I didn't pour a lot in the beginning. Can, can someone please come up with a lip on a bottle. I, I'm so bad at pouring these. I, it's not me, it's the bottles. It's probably me. But it's, it could be the bottles. <laughs> um... It's only I, like 95% of our bottles are licked by Tom. <laughs> well, it's my finger, not my actual thing. I'm chugging these things when he's not around anyways. Don't let him kid you. No, I, I definitely get that. I, I want to say this this definitely, because out of all the rye that we have, it reminds me, I mean, we can compare. I don't think we have anything that high proof on rye, though. 
But smell wise, I'm thinking I'm, I'm going towards like Riverboat where that's a 95.5. You don't have to drink it. We'll just, I just want to smell the difference on, there's not much of this left anyway, so I won't go nuts because in case we end up doing a rye review. You want to see a rye mashup? We have a bunch of them now. We were thinking about doing it. You have to almost go now. Let's try. All right. Well, I was just gonna go no, at least nose wise on on. I think this is a ninety five five ride. This is this is uh, I believe MGP. Um, so this is a high ride on it, and it's, it's what it's reminding me of. Color wise, it definitely got age on it. I mean, it's so much darker mm -hmm. than uh, what the riverboat is. But in no, nose that wise, actually it's, it's not bad. The nose no, is, it, that it's actually close. that actually has more mint on it. I think it, it does actually. It's 90 proof, just for reference sake. I didn't know what the proof was. I can't believe I saw that with the naked eye. <laughs> this actually, I, I might stand corrected. This actually has more mint than... Uh, it does. Mm. Than this one does. It does. Maybe this isn't a 95.5 then. It has a really good rye flavor though. It does. So for it those does. people that are like... Uh, it even it knows though, it has like... It, it's almost it's almost like a smoother nose. Mm-hmm. This one. Yes. Yeah. No, they're not even the same. But definitely not drinking drinkability. I mean, this that riverboat will go right down. Not a, not even right down though. Did you try it? I did. Because it has a different flavor. Nose. Not it's too definitely far a higher around. rye though. It's definitely a higher rye. This, I think, actually brings a little oak or something. It's bringing a whole different flavor, but this is only three years old. What was the price of Riverfoot? 50 bucks here, what was that? I like this one better. Right. <laughs> Hands down. I was just going on a price. I would spend the money. Well, this was $19.99 too, so let, let's be honest. When it comes to price, this was what, $49.99? Yeah. So you, you, you get what you pay for. I this agree. is not bad. No. This is much better. I agree. Yep. Yep. I I agree. If you if you can find this and you haven't not had any of them, well, the teal label, I would say try it. Excuse me. I would definitely say try it. No, I, it's actually very good. It is actually very good. I I, I do I do like that little bit of extra proof though. Well, by far. This this the, the yeah, this, this, is this one is definitely you can tell the, the and difference. It's, it's, this is it's a little sweeter. It is everything about it. And, and I mean, you get color. The mint, you can't but, even compare. No, They're you not get the mint and sweeter flavor. Everything wins with Pinhook. Is Riverboat bad? No. I'll be interested to see because this is going to be right around the price range. Uh, if we can find like like Russell's, Russell's or Rare Breed have rise. And if we can find them, well, I, I think we're going to be in that. Both I think we're going to be in that general price range with this. I'd be interested because they're going to be up in that proof. Do you know what I mean? I think that would be our best comparison. We're going to put this one aside. Rare breed definitely will be. It, I know the rare breed rye, and I want to say Russell's rye is up there too. Um, it'll bring us in Go that figure, price range. I know range. exactly where they are. It'll bring us in that price range, and I and then we have a better Pretty comparison. Close. I want to say it's forty nine ninety nine. I th I think we're comparing apples and oranges. This is a twenty dollar bottle to a fifty dollar bottle, and. Well, this one to, just okay, tastes, so we started less cast, more mash. This one beats it. Flavor wise. We were hoping that we were thinking. Not that I wouldn't buy Riverboat again. No. I would. That's actually really good. No, because if you if you're not the proof guy and you just want the flavor and that you like the rye, it, it's, it's the only difference suitable. with this one is it brings like that sweet it, oaky it's, finish. It's, it's to definitely it. sweet. It, it brings you This is mint pinier, mintier. Yeah, riverboat. The riverboat gives yeah. you that straight. Yeah. Rye. Yep. You're drinking rye whiskey. That's yep. all. You, you're just getting that. There's no sugar coating it. You get that straight pine. But this one brings a little sweet oak happiness in the in the bundle. It, get, it smooths it out, too. It's it's way higher proof. And I think it almost drinks softer. You, you, drink you, uh, you notice it more in, in there. But, but like, drinkability-wise, I think it almost drinks, like, to me, I... I no, it's very, it's very good. Again, if you see it, you haven't had it, if you're looking to expand, I would definitely get it. Mm -hmm. I'll be so, interested so to see. Not, not, that, not to tip, tip our hat, but I'll be interested to see how it compares to the other one. Like, is now it better or is it worse? see how the bourbon is. 
No, and both of them. That's what I'm saying. Like on on you know, will will the other one be better? We might have to do that one next. Like in the in the near, near future. future before we break out the bourbons, just to be able to compare them. You know what I mean? Because we have one more. And that was a high. That was a high ride. Right. I believe that said high high ride or something like that. That one did. I think that would be our best comparison. It would be more on the proof range. Even closer until we, yeah, get, yeah. until we get rare breed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's very good. Mm -hmm. I think you get a, the best of both worlds. You're getting that rye, but you do get that like that oaky sweetness and, and, at and the a end little, too. And a little... Not so much caramel. You, you're smelling no. the, the minty pine, but you get you get the flavor and you get a heat. It's it's just a good drinker. It is. It is actually. We wouldn't be wolfing this one. I don't know. We already filled the cup. <laughs> no, you have to wait because it's still here. Because yeah, we could sit. I know like, what you're saying. Riverboat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we, I mean, on the review, be... I'm trying to go back and forth, back and forth. But if I was just sitting there, I would have took a sip. I would have put it down. I would have let it sit for a little because bit. Because you still got a little tongue feel, and it's well, and it, it stays. stays not so much in your mouth. The the mouth goes away quick, but it stays like I, here. It's still numbness on my tongue. It, it just kind of like like to me, it's more my my throat. Not even down here. Just kind of, it's just kind of hanging out. Where but again, you, if you, still if you did feel. a shot of this, you'd know it. Yeah, I like it. No, I 100% I agree with you. That this was this was very good. I think it's very tasty. Um, again, it's 114 proof though. I want to say it's a little pricey at 50 bucks, but then again, I'm like, no, it depends what you're looking for. I don't. The well, only thing the only, that other than 114. My only thing that I keep saying uh, though, when you hit the 50 dollar mark. Is you're in the Russells. You're 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 in the old foresters. You're in that realm. With, do they carry more weight? Yeah, but this is a rye. Granted, it's a rye. That's what I was gonna say. We don't. Do we have an old forester rye? Not yet. I keep looking for it. That's another one that they. So have. I mean, you're, you're not that's talking, supposed to be a lot cheaper. You're doing apples and oranges. It's supposed to be a lot cheaper. I know, but now when I'm talking fifty dollars, you're but talking. If you're a rye guy, then I would th say this is very good. This is right up there in. Uh, just Will we be on a lookout for the Old Forester ride? This and the, could and the be Russell's ride a special and the occasion. Ride. If you're, you know, you're I, entertaining. I, I actually like the bottling. I like the concept. I like the whole thing. They, they, they make this one's just for rye humor. They have ones for other horses that go on the thing. I like the concept. I, I like everything about it. I'm not saying anything bad about that. My only thing is that forty nine ninety nine. Is there another one? But we haven't done a lot of expensive rides. You know what I mean? So I say when we when we get to it, buy. But uh, no, I agree. I agree. If you are a rye guy, I think it's pretty good. I mean, it, would this be your daily drinker? I would say probably not, unless you got a lot of money. But yeah. well, you, you say that, but they, they, we don't even have that. I can't think of the name of the rye. Anyways, this is right around 50, 60 bucks, and everyone raves about it. Don't, we have we have a few rye. So one one. It's not gonna taste the same. That's like twenty nine bucks or something. Twenty three. Twenty three dollars. That's what I'm saying. That was actually so, hard to find. Right but now. I'm I'm just saying. Yeah, yeah. Even you, even you Jack Daniels ride. Right. It's cheap. It's so cheap. I got a thing on it. Twenty five ninety nine. You know what I mean? All I'm saying those would be more. I would lean more towards a daily. A daily, correct. This come on. I would use this as a as a show. Right. No, it's 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 a, it's, it's definitely thicker. It's definitely and and the proof. Oh, I, I, it's, I, I, it's worth trying. If I got nothing. If you're a rye guy and you haven't been to this level, I would definitely try it. I agree. I agree. I'm not gonna. I, I'm not trying to argue. I, I just when I see that that thing. But it is. So I, I guess I have a stickler in my head because I did shit on Makers Forty Six on well, the price thing, and I, I don't want to do that. And I don't want to do it because it's 114 pro. So oh, that's yeah, the other. That, the other that, honestly, honestly, that's where I'm. I'm torn because, I mean, out of all the rides we have, they might be cheaper, but they're not 114 proof. No, they're not. And they don't taste like no, you're not drinking. This doesn't drink like 114 proof to me. Either. I, I could go get one of these and be happy. I agree. Myself. I agree. Like, I, I think the it, problem it, with it is, to me, it actually drinks a lot less. The and problem I is could be where silly. I got these, they're already gone. Oh, I'm sure. I'm they sure. Uh, they only they only come out. I like, stopped yesterday. Yeah, no, I don't doubt that. So, all, right. all all of them had all of these except for one were five deep, and they're all gone. 
have all that. But anyway, if, you know, it, I said, remember when I sent you the picture of, I think Maker's Mark made specialty bottles with the with the horses on it and stuff like that. You know those are getting scooped up. You know what's weird, though, is thing. that Maker's... Oh, did we do that one yet? Yeah. Oh, it's not out. Oh, yeah, it should be out. The 101? Yep. They still have that. Yeah. I'm this close to getting that. I, I, again, I haven't, I haven't Sorry. seen that in my story. Mental but, thought. No, they that, that, me, one, but... that one will already be out. Yeah. We've... Talked long enough. It's All right. Two. That's it. So, Rye Humor, <laughs> I recommend it. I, I yes. do. Give it a try. It is forty nine ninety nine. so try at your own risk and know that you got to like rye because it does give no, that. You, right. If you're it not does a rye give guy, that higher money. rye flavor, not to the extent of that, but right. it's well polished compared to oh, yeah. the other I agree. one. So, there you go. We'll leave it at that. Thank you for watching. Spend less, drink more. Cheers. Cheers. And subscribe. He just wants a treat. You yeah. didn't say so. That drink's nice. Even oh, I, 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 I saved it, so I have some right at that.